Here at Banbury Police Station. I just came along just to I'd like to tell you about a story that's happened to me a while ago. But before I do that, I'm gonna go inside and tell them that I'm outside doing this. Hey look, somebody threw a nigger. Well, oh, yeah. Everybody likes him there. It's pretty obvious. Yeah, that is an egg, isn't it? How dirty is that? Hey guys. Hi. Hi. Uh, just to let you know, I'm just around the air, uh, just the police station, just making a video. Okay. That's all. Just uh, because last time I did that, uh, I had four police officers that came at me like crazy and they put me in handcuffs and everything. Okay, you come here for a reason, have you? I'm just around, uh, just to let you know that I'm, I'll be outside making a video. Why? That's all. Is there any particular reason? Uh, I can't tell you right now, but the reason I'm telling you is so, like I said, last time I'd done this, four police officers came, they put me in well, handcuffs that, you, and you know, because it, it was crazy. It was reasonable for us to understand because yeah, yeah. We, we, we take the security of police stations very seriously. Yeah, of course, I understand. Yeah. But I'm not doing anything, it's just making a story. No, but I'm just we, gathering... we don't know that you're not. Um... Oh, right. I'm telling you, I'm not. I'm definitely not. Well, I, you know, so what I'm going to do? I'm going to go all around the, the police station. No, that's that's not. Are you recording now, sir? Yes, sir. Yeah. Okay. So I'll be doing this now, yeah. Well, why are you doing it, sir? I'm just making a story. I'm just letting yeah, but you know. So it says you, but what story are you making? Well, it's just a story. I think we need an officer to speak to you, then, sir. Don't we? Really? Yeah, because the security of police stations is a top priority. I understand, I understand. Tracy? Yeah. Can you get one? If you can. Yeah? Because you, you, you know... I'll be outside, yeah. I'll, I've let you know that I'm around and making well, the story. Yeah, yeah, but you're not... You're saying that, but how do we know you're not uh, videoing it to uh, to find insecure premises so which you could then attack a police station? No, I wouldn't do anything like no, that. Definitely not. Anyway, I'm outside doing my video. I've, I did tell you just so it doesn't happen like last time I got handcuffed well, then, and everything. Well, Please don't send anybody to handcuff me. Thank you. Great. Anyway, let's go back to the story. Okay, so yes, like you, you heard me. Last time I, I came here, I went well, I started, to be honest, I started at the back, over there. I'll, uh, I'll show you now. Uh, hang on. Oh. Yes, just there. So what I did last time, as you can... Oh, they've changed it a little bit. As you can see, all these bollards, there's loads of bollards here. Last time they went there. And what, they, what, what I saw, there was like uh, cars parked on the double yellow. Yeah, see this double yellow there? So there was loads of cars not respecting the double yellow. And they were clearly, they were police officers like parked there. So what I did, all I did is took a couple of pictures. I just wanted, I wanted to put them on Facebook. And that's all it is, basically just to show that police don't respect the rules. Blah, blah, blah. As I was walking on this road, uh, a police officer came after me. And before I even realized, I tried to switch my camera on. He just grabbed it off my hands. So he didn't allow me to, re to, to record. And this is, why, this is why you obviously don't see the video. The police officer, his name was John Shepherd, and his badge number was 127. So it was exactly here. Right, so they started searching me and all that, and then they just put me in handcuffs and they searched me under the Terrorism Act, and there we are. Uh, hang on a second. Hello, sir, how are you? Hi, I'm good, oh. thank you. You're just going to ruin my, my story now. Okay, I'm very sorry to do that. Um, yeah. My name's Susie Goodman, I'm Hi. a police officer from Banbury. Susie, yeah, um, uh, one, this is my two, colleague, 1297. 1297, and you are? 5550. 550, and your name is? Katie Rhodes. All right, are you okay? Yeah, I'm good, thank you. 
Am I being detained? No, no. So I can just carry on my story or? Yeah. But, I mean, obviously one of our colleagues has come out to speak to you. And now, I want you to let them know that I'm here. Yeah, but so you've, and then when he's asked you why you're filming. Yeah, I told him what I'm um, doing. But you, well, but you wouldn't explain to me what, been, explain to him I did. why? I did. What, what is your reason, I'm sir? making a story. About? But just a story. Like okay. a fictional story or? A what? Fictional, like not real, made up. Like, fictional. Like, yeah, fictional. No, no, fiction, it's a story. Fiction. fiction. No, I'm not Spielberg. I'm just making a story. Because obviously, from from our perspective, mm -hmm. um, this is a, a working police station. We have police officers working here. We have police officers parking. This is my over. police station. I just need to they, remind you they, that I've been a resident of Banbury for a long time. Okay, so I've been paying for this for a long time. Then yes. The community, but we okay. All work here. Let's, let's make it clear. We serve the community of Banbury, That's and it. we park our private vehicles here. Okay. Those vehicles can be identified. Okay. If you're going around filming our vehicles then obviously we would be interested in knowing why you're doing recording. This is why I came in and I told them that. But, but why, sir? I'm why making a story. It's just a story. Why do you need to be filming around the police station? The problem is sir? if I tell you the reason why, you might jeopardise the story. Well, not not if you're going to be putting our safety in place. You've already jeopardised my story. No, no, I'm not putting your safety at risk. I'm, I'm not doing anything hostile in here. Nothing at all. But I'm just videoing. It's strange not... that you're not willing to, to be a little bit more forthcoming. I am. A, oh my God, I just came in and I've told them inside that I'm going to be around making a video, uh, taking footage for a story. That's what I told him that. And he's telling me that I wasn't, I didn't tell you, I did. Just, I'm being very transparent here. We, yeah, but we were just interested oh, sorry. in what the story is. Because like okay. explained, I could have came in, I could have came just video the whole place without letting you know anything. Right, yeah? but, but can you understand why we might still be interested in, in what the story is? Like my colleague says, you, like, you say you're not you're not being hostile, it's not a hostile story no, or not. anything like that, and that's fine, okay. and you, you might not be being hostile, but there could be people that then watch your story and see the vehicles that are parked outside. And well, this is in public domain, what are you talking about? I understand, but if our private vehicles are parked here, yeah. and people start trying to identify us in the vehicles and stuff like that, because unfortunately you can get information from huh. our vehicles. Yeah, but anybody can just walk past and have a look at them and take a picture of that, you know and it. if they did, it, yeah. if, and if we became aware of that, we would come out and we would ask them the same question. Why are well, why are you looking at our cars? Taking pictures of our vehicles, yeah. You can't tell people why are you looking at our cars. Well, you can say Well, you can ask, but that's yeah, a silly question. That would be a silly question, no, wouldn't it? Not, not really, sir. So no, if somebody can, walks no, past consider. here, he looks at that car, and you tell him why you're looking at that car? No, you said anyone can come past and take a picture. I said if we noticed that, we would come out and ask them about it. All right, it's okay. And that's all we're doing with you. You're taking a video, and we're just, we're just trying to understand why you're taking that video. So when the, you know when the Google car went past mm -hmm. and took pictures of everything, did you ask him? They blur it all out, though, don't they? Did you? you, did you but did you ask him, though? Well, well, if you I, don't know what I'm going to do in my video. You don't know if I'm going to blur it or I'm not going to blur it. If, if did I, you ask if Google? Found, did I you ask Google? Google? That's the question. I wasn't here when Google okay, did it, then. so how could I Yeah, understand? but you know they have done it. Why don't you send them a letter so and ask them the really question? I don't understand that. That's slightly beyond what we're talking about. We're it's just not. Asking, we're asking you what it is that you are requiring this information for. You're telling us that you're doing I'm a making story, a story. You're correct. And, you know, and that is... Totally Which you've ruined already because I need to start again. But it... You've got to also appreciate that in this current climate... Oh, what climate is that? Where we're we've had officers threatened. We're having officers threatened, we're having officers... Well, I know we've got the leaves coming down and everything, but it's not raining, it's not that cold either. So I don't know what, what's the current... I don't really understand what you're talking about, the weather. She's forward. talking about the, the climate. So you're being pedantic. No, she just mentioned the climate, and no, I've told her the climate yeah, is fine. You know she doesn't mean that kind of climate. Well, what does she mean? Like the, the, the situation as it is at the moment. So what's happened? Well, what's the, the ever happened in Banbury Police used, Station? It's not just Banbury Police Station. You're talking because about terrorism. Are you talking about terrorism? No, we're not. No, we're, not. We're, we're talking, talking about, about safety that... of police officers in general. It doesn't matter what culture anybody comes from, sir. We are at threat all of the time. I didn't mention people. any culture. You obviously, if you, you just, say you the current climate, I think you mean terrorism. No. Because no, I can't remember. About any... that we lost a colleague in, in August, sir. I've, I've, I've lost a lot of friends. I've lost a lot of uh, right, but that family and stuff. So. Terrorism. So what's talking yeah. about risks to us? It doesn't mean terrorism. It means the risks to us from anyone. The one in August, as far as I'm aware, and unless you've got information that you wish to share, had nothing to do with terrorism. And how many, how many people, the police murdered in the police stations? 
you, How many? You have You've no asked me a question, I've answered it to you, and I, you as need to answer back to me. Aware, no police have been murdered in No, no, not police. police member of the public, like oh, me. I, and I, I, how I many, don't know. How I don't many know. people the police abused? How many people? You know, it's an endless right, story. So is that, is that what you're trying to get at, sir? No, no, no. I, I'm, re I'm responding to, to your answers. The fact that the police abused people No, there's no issues. No, no, you've asked, you told me. Sorry, I dismissed that. So you're clearly here for a purpose. What purpose? That it's not a legitimate purpose. How do you mean? Are you doing a story about the police or are you just walking up and down the Warwick Road and doing I'm doing story? a story about the police, yes. Right, okay. So what is this story about? I can't tell you until they've done it. It's a, because uh, it's very... Hi. Uh, it's very simple. It's like going to a writer who's writing a book and telling him what's the story about. He will never tell you until the book is done. But I, I don't yeah? understand why it would be necessary for you to walk I'm around not filming our personal vehicles around the police station. I'm not specifically filming your that, police vehicles. And, and then and they're you, not police vehicles. You're not being transparent about what it is that you're, you're writing well, I'm not specific. Sir. I will answer that question. I'm not specifically videoing the vehicles. Yeah, obviously I'm walking past it. I'm sure they're going to be on it. Are but you I'm not specifically. Are you looking security, sir? Are you testing the security of the building? The security of the building? Yes. Not is that really, what you're no. interested in? Not really, no. So what is the purpose of you filming I told you, I'm making a story. I mean, how many times do you want me to tell you this? You've talked about uh, the police abusing people and stuff like that. Is no, that I didn't. You, you did. You said a police officer died. Yeah. I said members of the public die every day. And then yeah, you I've asked just responded how many people, and then you asked how to your many question. Had been murdered in, in the station. Yeah, I hear how all the time. Hang on, hang on. So you brought up. No, no, you, no, no, you brought that up. I don't have to let you finish. I don't have okay, to do well, anything. I don't have to let you finish. Well, I don't care. You came to me. Okay, we're done. Thank you. My God. Sir. Now they wonder why they get hit by eggs all the time. So anyway, I can't even remember what I was. Uh, you know what, forget it. I don't want to carry on my story. Here we go, so yeah, getting back to the video. So I was standing here and uh, yeah, I was put in handcuffs and, and they searched me under the terrorism act. And uh, you know, I thought it was out of order really. So I came back today, you know, just to tell my story. And that's what I get, just more abuse, more crap, more... It's just unbelievable, and you think I should listen to them and I should have to... I don't have to do anything, and so I'm here, it's my police station, I pay for it, it's coming out for my tax, I can video it, I can talk about it, I can, I can do anything I like at the end of the day. I'm a free citizen, and that's the end of the story. Anyway, uh, yeah, uh, that's it, bye.